The other common way in which a clip stick is used is to clip the bolts as you go up a route so you can work the moves in between each bolt. And in this way, you'd always have a rope above you. So it's very common to do this maybe when you're trying a route really at your limit and you don't want to be taking lots of repeated leader falls, but you want to have sort of the rope above you to climbing up. So the first thing we're going to do is have the first bolt clipped, which I've got here, and I'm sort of tied on and ready to climb up. They're going to attach the clip stick to my harness and I'm going to climb up. If I'm ever going to sort of climb with a clip stick attached to me, then I always need to make sure I've got the rope above me because I don't want to be in a situation where I could actually take a leader fall with a stick attached to my harness like this. It's pretty obvious that I could sort of hurt myself as a stick dug into my leg or something like that. Okay, so I'm going to sort of set off and when I get to the first bolt, I'm going to be clipping the next bolts above me. So we'll look at that when I get up there. When I get to the first bolt, what I do is I get a, an extender and I clip it into my harness. Then I clip this either into a carabiner of the extender that's already there or into the bolt. And what I actually ensure I do is that when I use this extender, I clip the end that's designed for the rope into my harness and the end that's designed for the bolt into either the bolt or the carabiner. And there's a good reason for that because you want to ensure that this this end of the extender only is ever going to be on the rope or in this case my, my soft textile central loop of my harness. So clip that in to the first bolt. I then pull up a load of slack that I'm going to use to clip the rope into the next bolt. With the rope pulled up I then get an extender and put it on to the clip stick. I then with the slack rope pulled up I clip it in to the extender, reach up with a clip stick and clip it into the next bolt. I then tell Rob that I'm on the next bolt and I can unclip myself from the first bolt. With the rope clipped into the bolt above I can then pull up on the rope a little bit and sort of work out the moves and then I can lower down and work them again so I, I'm working the moves as the rope's above me continue that process until I get to the top. So once you've worked your route to the top and you've got all the quick draws in and you've lowered off, you may want to have a go at giving it a clean ascent. But what you want to try and do again is have the rope in the first quick draw. So a little nifty trick you can do with a clip stick can help you do that. First of all, I'm going to get a, a sort of a toothbrush here and put it in there. You could also use a twig or anything else like that. I'm going to extend the clip stick a bit and then with this little sort of crook I've made on the clip stick I can reach up to the first bolt and just pull down and then once I have got the rope I can just pull it through all the way from the top and now the rope is through the first quick draw only, so I'm ready to give my route a go.